What's up guys? Hello Shiro Toy Reviews doing another unboxing slash review. This time on something I've been dying to have. And unfortunately, um, this item is like extremely rare and I did kind of pay a lot for it. Um, but like I said, it was rare and I would have regretted it if I had not bothered like getting it so <laughs> um but without further ado uh, let's see what I got um now I have covered this set of figures and I've given a brief history of this toy line on my uh, in previous videos um but uh, as you can see I got um, 3A Action Portable, Little Shadow, um, let's see, let me get the tape off, yeah, Little Shadow, um, so unfortunately in the description, because I got her from eBay, the seller had the packaging, um, but instead he just shipped it, shipped the figure just in the case, so that's a little, a little disappointing, I will be keeping the case though, but, you know, but yeah, um, so I've talked about 3A before, um, if I can get a better image. Um, yeah, I've talked about 3A before, um, so currently with Little Shadow, I have three, um, Adventure Cartel figures, um, 112, there's the back of her, um, I own Cherry Bomb, which I received broken, and I had to fix her. Um, <laughs> and I have a kit bash of Tommy Mission, who is from, well, at least the head is from Adventure Cartel. Um, but yeah, there's a few others I'd like to get. Um, I actually, not to spoil any future reviews for the remainder of this week, but I actually bought another Adventure Cartel figure from the same seller who, who I bought this little shadow from. But, um, yeah, so I, I have a few uh, 3A uh, related packages coming and one um, accessory coming. Um, but, yeah, I will save those for when they arrive. But, um, yeah, so without further ado, let's check out Little Shadow. Okay, guys, here she is in all her 112th glory. Um, unfortunately, I have limited battery space, so I'm going to try to make this uh, review kind of brief. But um, I removed her jacket so you can see the detail on her. Um, one thing I really love about this little shadow is just all the detail that went into into her. Um, and this design is based off a 1-6 scaled version of her. Um, so, you no, know, just the, the weathering on the clothes and her jeans and her high top sneakers. I just really dig it. Um, I really dig the plaid skirt since the uh, Cherry Bomb wears a plaid tube top, which is cool. Um... So yeah, I just love her aesthetic so much. Um, she's just very, very cool to look at. Um, so as you can see, she comes with a skull and an open palm hand and her jacket, which is very weathered. Um, I guess here's somewhat of a comparison. So here's the one that Cherry Bomb comes with, which is the same thing, just painted to look kind of red. I think her bomb, Cherry Bomb's skull looks more like a candle or a wax candle or something. Um, but that's, yeah, I think that's pretty cool. And here is Cherry Bomb's fist. So you can see her gloves are brown and Shadow has kind of like these gray kind of colored gloves. Um, yeah. So unfortunately, I notice on her right foot... It's kind of loose, which is kind of a bummer. Um, I don't think that was a seller's fault since he told me, if he was telling the truth, that he only had these on display for a little while and he put them back in their packaging. So, yeah, but I mean, I've noticed with the female figures, the ankle, the ankle joints are always kind of loose. So, 
that's kind of a bummer, but you know, I'm not going to mess with it. I'm going to leave it alone. Um, yeah, she's just, she's posable, just like Cherry Bomb, but because of her clothing, it does kind of hinder the posability, which actually doesn't bother me, to be honest, just because of how solid she looks. Um, as you can see, that's what she looks like next to Tommy, um, which I think is the is the proper size, even though he's not wearing his original um, clothes. But I think that's pretty funny because I believe these two, yeah, these two are dating. These two are boyfriend and girlfriend, or they have an on and off relationship. I don't really remember. Like, so I'm not sure if there's like an actual comic to read. I'm, 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 I'm going to have to Google that because I really want to, you know, see more of the world that these characters come from. But I believe they're boyfriend and girlfriend. Um, but, you know, she's wearing high top sneakers, so that's why she's taller. But in actuality, I believe Shadow is actually kind of short. So in the one six figures, Tommy is taller than her. But, yeah, but yeah, they look cool together. Um, you know, it's kind of whatever. Uh, well, take him out for a moment. Um... So here she is next to her counterpart. She stands. Oh, yep. So here she is next to Cherry. And you're probably wondering, why the heck does Cherry have on this big floppy sweatshirt? Well, I wanted to mess around with her. And since my I put my Garden Palmer figure away, my Elsa figure, I put her away. I took the sweatshirt she was wearing and threw it on Cherry Bomb just to see how it would look, and yeah, um, so that's why she's wearing that floppy, too big sweatshirt, um, but yeah, so I'm going to say my pros and cons um, with these two figures. Now, I will say I like Shadow, I like Little Shadow a lot more just because of how detailed she is and all the, you know, all the clothing pieces she comes with, um, but yeah, and Cherry, but Cherry Bomb is also unique, um, you know, but there's not a lot going for her. I And I believe Cherry Bomb and Little Shadow are the same person. Um, like, Cherry Bomb is Shadow's alter ego. I'm not entirely sure how the whole thing works. Um, but from what I heard and what I read, that's what it's supposed to be. But they're, they're supposed to be the same person. Um you know, like, Shad Cherry Bomb is unique, but she's just kind of basic, you know, but she has a more kind of feminine um, look to her. And Shadow has a more tomboy, I guess, kind of punk, you know, vibe to her, which I really like. Um, but yeah, but between the two, Shadow is my favorite, but I, I still like Cherry Bomb. Um, but yeah, so my only problem is that I feel like these figures are kind of a cop out because they're the same character, even though they're supposed to represent different versions of the characters. Um, there was a, there was one female character who's also an adventure cartel who unfortunately did not get a one twelfth figure. I really wish they made a one twelfth figure of her, but unfortunately this wave only had, you know, series one. They didn't, they never made a series two, um, and I think, to my knowledge, all these figures in the series are basically just, like, scaled-down versions of existing, like, 1, 6, 12-inch figures. But, um, yeah, so that's kind of a bummer. But, you know, hey, you know, I could always... I really dig the 1, 12, fig, 3A figures, so, you know, I'm happy to have them either, either way. Um, so, yeah, I actually looked... Um, I looked under all the, all the protection... In the package, so the seller did uh, throw in the card, which I'm thankful for. So I will really quick. I will say I have. So I have. Let's see. I have Shadow, Cherry, and a Kit Bash of Tommy. So those are the only three figures I have, and I have another figure on the back of this card coming later this week from the same seller I bought Little Shadow from, but I will not, I will save that for when I do that video review. Um, but pretty much, I've seen 
all these figures for the most part for sale on eBay, but you know, they're all kind of a little pricey. Um, but I pretty much want every figure on this list. So, I mean, on this card. So hopefully I will get around to getting all those figures at some point. Um, JC. Okay, guys. Um, so unfortunately my video cut off because of my low battery. But, um, yeah, so to end, to end this video off, um, if you can find her, if you're interested in getting into the 112 3A figures, I highly recommend her. Just, like I said, be weary that these figures are expensive and they're not being made anymore and they're kind of on the fragile side, so you have to be extra careful when um, handling these figures. Um, yeah, do not break them. Do, please do not break them or you will be very, very upset. But, um, yeah, so I recommend her. So, yeah, yeah, she's a solid figure. Um, but yeah, like, comment, and subscribe and stay tuned for more. Peace, you guys.